Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing okay. Welcome back to my channel. Today is actually Monday and I feel like I've woken up with a little bit of motivation, which is quite surprising because last night I went to bed feeling quite overwhelmed. You know when you just have a lot on your mind, like a lot of things to do and you just don't know where to start. So I thought to myself this morning, instead of just coming home and doing my usual cleaning and just pottering about, I'm actually gonna start getting some of the jobs ticked off my list because I feel like every room I walk into, there's little bits and bobs that need doing and I just never get around to doing them. And a lot of the time, I must admit, it's because the jobs are wills jobs and they're things that i tell myself i can't do i'm here most of the time so if i can do some of these jobs and start getting things ticked off and making the house feel more like a home um i'm gonna be less overwhelmed and have all this stuff on my mind and waiting for will to do it and you know what it's like at weekends like we want to spend time with the kids and we don't really want to be doing like a lot of house stuff because we are going to be doing the kitchen soon so there's like a lot that's going to go into that so i'm going to try my best to get some of the jobs on my list ticked off some little corners around the house a little bit more homely and yeah today i thought i could start off in manny's room because we have a little corner over here which i'm going to show you in a minute and i had a little idea a few months ago because he actually used to have a chalkboard and it took up so much room and i really wanted to get him a little table that he could sit at to do like his coloring and playing and things like that so i thought i saw this chalkboard paint and i thought I could make a chalkboard on the wall. The only thing is I decided to make kind of like a wall mural in chalkboard and for that I needed Will to draw it. But I came up with the idea this morning that I could trace some of these corals and stuff and fish onto a piece of paper and then draw that onto the wall is that gonna work how will that work anyway i'm gonna try it um and then i'm gonna paint it so i hope that it goes okay will has put the black um plug switches in for me a couple of weeks ago but i'm just gonna try my best and see how it comes out and if not maybe will can fix it but yeah we will see how we get on i'm now thinking how am i gonna like put that on the bit of paper but then how am I going to get it on the wall because I don't have tracing paper I was going to put it on white paper but then I can't get it on the wall maybe I'm going to have to freehand it I don't think I'm the best at drawing but we will see so I'm going to just have a little tidy round first and then I will show you the little corner that I'm working with because I really want to get some cute little pen pots and like just make it a little cute crafty corner for him um, and we are going to be getting a new bed soon because he just doesn't sleep in here. He constantly wants to be with Marley in his room like all the time. Every single night he wakes up like five times a night and he tries to sneak through. Um, so we're going to put Marley's old bed up. And this is another thing. Like I feel like I've got to wait for Will to do that. But could I do that? I don't know how to use a drill, but maybe I could try. And if I put that up and I ordered a mattress and bedding, like that would be another job done. So I don't know, I'm going to try my best to start getting some of these things ticked off my list to have a more organised, motivated year, as well as decluttering and stuff. I feel like it will help me in getting my year more organised. So yeah. So this is the corner that I'm working with and I thought I could do the chalkboard paint on this one. And here I have some of the stuff that I thought I might need. I just need to go and get a little um, handle to put that on. But I've got some frog tape so I can put it along the skirting board so I don't get it on there. I've got two different paint brushes because these look the smallest. 
So I'm going to give them a go. I've got a thing to put the paint in and then this is the paint. So this is the Johnstone's blackboard paint and it is magnetic as well, which I thought was really good because then he could put his letters on there. And then here's my paper and pencil, which I thought I could <laughs> trace these like on here, but I just, it's obviously not going to work because I'll trace it onto the paper. But then I can't get it onto the wall. Yeah, wish me luck. Um, and I'm going to try now to draw some bits on the wall. Oh God, please go right for me. I could feel this way And it's kind of strange Don't even know your name having a little pit stop um so far i've done the coral and a little fish up there and some bubbles which i saw over there as well um it will need another coat because you can see like it's still a bit sheer um and i need to touch up some little bits like where i've messed up but my hand is honestly like this like it's shaking the whole time it's so difficult but it's really easy as well so i just um yeah, I need to just get in the motion of it. So I've got these bits done here. And then on this side, you can see the outline of a stingray because I thought a stingray is a big fish. So he'll have more space to draw on. And you can see there's one there. The only thing is you're not gonna be able to see its face. So I don't know how it's gonna look. Um, but also I needed to ask because I don't know why I'm needing to ask because I probably would have finished it by the time you see this video but I've got to hang these little baskets because obviously they've got the chalk so I just need to figure out where to put them before I draw the stingray because maybe I won't have the stingray there because these are going to need to hang and I've also got another one with magnetic letters in so I'm just thinking like I quite like here but then his table is gonna sit there um yeah maybe i'll just put one on the wall or i could put one in the corner as well i need them like at his height as well so there's a lot to think about maybe the chalk will go i've got a lovely little wooden peg for it to go on um but yeah what do you think so far i can't wait to give it another coat i really hope will don't come home and laugh and be like what the hell is this <laughs> um but yeah hopefully by the end it will look okay to know you just want to get to know you i know know you but i want to get to know you just want to get to know you
I wondered if I should put something down here, but I've got these little hooks that I need to pop on the wall. I'm thinking to put one there and put the chalk in it. Um, I don't know if two baskets is going to look a bit much and I'm not going to know until I put it on. But yeah, the next thing I'm doing is sticking this on. I've still got a little bit of green tape there, which I need to take off when he's dry. But I've just taken off here. And that is such a nice clean cut there. So yeah, that is dry. Just waiting for that one to dry. I might need to do another little bit of touching up there. But yeah, I'm going to put this on next. I saw you from across the room. Okay, so I've just popped that on and here is my little chalkboard wall mural done um i don't know whether to add a few more little bits of bob but i'm gonna just leave it like this just for now and i'm gonna see when will gets home what he thinks but yeah the table is gonna go here so i just want to go get some little pens and pots and things not pens actually no crayons would be good in here um so that he can have his little crafty corner here Oh, and I didn't decide to put the other one of these hanging on here with the letters in because these letters don't work on here. I don't think the magnetic is enough on the back of here. So yeah, they don't actually work on here. So I'm not gonna hang another little basket and I think that is more than enough. I never know that I could feel this way And it's kinda strange 